break as we delve into uh, entrepreneurship and uh, talk about how you can uh, make money online because uh, people would say boys are not smiling, the streets are really, really tough and uh, the, the economy of the country is uh, really a bit um, on the challenging side right now. So one just has to brace up you know, to look for alternative sources of income. Now my guest, Timi Ajibewa, popularly known as Electric Timi, is a highly sought after speaker, trainer and resort coach in the business and personal development niches in Nigeria. She captivates her audience and clients with her ability to ignite possibilities. As a fellow at the Institute of Corporate Mentoring and Coaching, Timmy is the CEO of Win or Win Consult, a coaching and consulting services company that empowers thought leaders through her mentoring, training and coaching services. The company operates in Nigeria and the United States of America. Timmy is the founder of the Millionaire Housewife Academy, a leading edutech platform that enables women to leverage technology to create impact, influence and income from their homes. She is also the visionary behind uh, Transformers Mentoring Hub, a movement designed to transform the minds of young people aged between 16 to 24 through life coaching and mentoring. The program prepares them to contribute to their country's economies and Africa's greatness, among all the many feathers she has on her cup. Let's make welcome to me. Timmy, good morning to you. Good morning. Thank you. Yes. Good to have you yet again on Business Insights. Yeah, right. Yeah. It's, it's, it's good to be here. <laughs> it's good to be back. So how's it been, really, uh, since the last time you were here and now uh, in the wake of uh, all of uh, the economic challenges the country mm. and even most part of the world uh, have been faced with? Right. So um, I've had to transition okay. to attend to more important and needed services in the coaching space mm. and so when i was here the last time i was a personal brand strategist okay. you know uh, even though i began as a make money online mm. millionaire housewife mm. brand but now i sit fully mm. in my space as make money online make money coach online. yes oh, that's cool <laughs> interesting that's what we're discussing today making money online because we need to make all the monies we can get to like i introduced on the show now because uh Things are desperately tough mm. and mm. challenging. People mm. are even finding it hard to, you know, just uh, get the average, uh, you know, daily bread, which is really very expensive right now. So let's just uh, start this way: making money online. What are the things that one needs to really bear in mind? Thank you very much. There are two major things you need to bear in mind when you think making money online. The first thing you want to do is think of your current existing business model mm. and create a channel to market that business online mm -hmm. no matter what you sell you are a barber you are a hairdresser you are a hospital you are a lawyer whatever service you currently have you want to maximize the internet social media in particular mm. google you know to promote your existing business you can't afford to do business only mm. with the people who can see you mm. with the people brick and mortar brick and mortar no so when you promote yourself i was going to fix my nails some days ago mm. i just googled mm. salons near me i thought you did it online <laughs> <laughs> i found them online okay salons near me mm. and i'm sure i got they, were, they are more than those i saw online okay thankfully i saw one online. i called them on oh, the phone wow. they're like oh yes you're available we don't fix nails but mm. there's a nail shop below us mm. so please come in okay and i walked there okay that's a very classical example mm. of making money online okay the second thing to bear in mind is what services are you rendering can i deliver online Okay, but before you even talk about what services you can deliver, by the way, the nails are great, I guess. Thank <laughs> you. Before you talk about uh, what services to deliver online, so are you saying exactly that um, just practically anyone can just uh, be online with whatever they do? Yes. Okay. A resounding yes. Aha. So no one has any excuses. No. And it's okay if you can't do it. Mm. Talk to one, two, three people. Look for any of your educated cousins or nephews or, or children. Yes. Ask them to put your business on Google My Business. It is free. Uh -huh. <laughs> 
Oh, so you actually just make the most of it. Yes. Okay, so go ahead. So you talked about uh, the what? other part. Yes, please. Then what services can you deliver online? Mm -hmm. What digital products mm. can you offer online? Mm -hmm. Now, if you are educated, yes. you have a degree or something, or you've had years of experience mm -hmm. on a job, you have gathered some knowledge, mm -hmm. some skills, mm -hmm. some expertise. Nothing precludes you from offering that expertise online. Okay. Consultations, uh -huh. pick my brain sessions, mm. webinars, ebooks, templates. Mm. People are buying contract templates from lawyers. Uh -huh. You can have, cons I mean, webinars, online oh, courses. This is actually endless. So it's just for one as it is now to think out of the box because yes. even from the little that you think you do there's even uh, monetization that could come out of yes mm. absolutely so i have made money online for the past 10 years I'm going to collect some. <laughs> <laughs> just, no, so seriously so it's not like a novel thing you've been doing for no, 10 years yes. something that one could actually just uh, you know no, it's, not, like, it's not a uh, yahoo yahoo thing yes mm. the millionaire housewife is 10 years this wow. year so before COVID became a thing, I have been working from home. Mm -hmm. I raised my two kids from home, ran my business from home. And the money is sweet because your overhead is near, near zero. zero yes. No, um, um, no but, uh, paying rent mm -hmm. for a shop or something or for an office. No overhead of stocking. Mm -hmm. No, it's just your knowledge and it, mm -hmm. it is inexhaustible mm -hmm. for you to share the knowledge over and over now you may say something mm -hmm. that but there is google mm -hmm. there is knowledge everywhere yeah. yes there is but there is no customized curated knowledge mm -hmm. people are still looking for your experience, your experience yeah. you are a man yeah. there is, you have an age you don't have your own personal story that mm -hmm. people want to like, hear yeah, they want to connect with. Yeah. That's the word to okay. relate with. Mm. So Google will just give me something generic it's online. Random. random. Mm. ChatGPT has even spurs things. It's so mechanical. <laughs> it's so sounding like it's it's a robot. Mm. But when you say you can teach me to be a broadcaster, yes. I want to hear from you. Yes. Bring your years of experience. Tell me I made these mistakes. I made these mistakes. Climb my shoulder and then pay a token to sit in a master class with me. Okay. You can have a master class of 10, 20 people mm. paying you. 50,000 Naira, 100,000 Naira. I run programs that run as high as 2.5 million Naira okay. for three months coaching, mm. six weeks coaching, and people pay because knowledge mm. is power when it is implemented. All right. Justin, don't you think you just learn how to start coaching too? So <laughs> <laughs> it's not even about coaching. No, 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 just even that. training. Let's not mm. even gra grand grandize it or what's the word yeah, now? It's, like it's not it, yeah, it's mm. not just coaching mm. because coaching needs certifications. Okay. But training. Mm. So basically, so long as you have some knowledge, you can actually impart it. Yes. Mm. Okay, it's as though someone is actually, you know, preaching sister. Yes. <laughs> This is a very interesting conversation. You know, so the truth is that you just have to bring yourself or put yourself out there. And uh, okay, what about uh, for you talked about the Baba? Let's talk to the SMEs right now for those who might not really have the main formal education. I just mm -hmm. want you to give like a step by step, uh, you know, uh, you know, ways to go about it. For instance, uh, I have a Baba shop and I just uh, want to be able to bring people, you know, and I do it very well, but I just need to get. Uh, the number so how do i go about it fantastic open a gmail account for your business mm. while you are opening it it asks you for location okay address and things like that mm. as you are putting it in it is telling you to link your location to pin it okay and so they will send an agent now it's the agent you may have to sort you know mm. for that transfer fee and things like that mm -hmm. but the service itself is free from google mm. so Ask you to get an, a, 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 an agent to come and see your location and confirm it is true because yeah. Google will not want to lead them to a wrong place. Okay. They will ask you to put your address, your phone number, contact, the direction to that location, and that is it. Okay. You become live. Mm. So when people Google your business name, that name will come up online. Mm. It could also be you buy a domain name. Okay. 
in your company name yeah. a hosting host domain as a website mm -hmm. and simply put whatever whatever babashop.com and then put in your services your address and that becomes googleable okay. online mm. it's really really basic you wouldn't believe it <laughs> okay, let's look at another another way um, about it now because at a time when uh, practically everyone is going into content and um, production and everything which is another way people are cash now that it is so long as you know how to really go about it yes. what would you really advise you know and some people they really want to get into it but uh, they are really a bit uh, taken aback as by how to start or what exactly they can do or what they can make it really very uh what's the word captivating so they can actually get all the attention good good great question thank you the first steps i recommend mm. the first step is clarify what solution you want to offer mm. what is the solution you want to deliver because people may not pay you to get into heaven but they will pay you to get out of hell what is the hell you want to pull people out of you must know the hell you are pulling them out of they would pay you to solve their problems so identify the problem you want to solve clarify who you also want to solve the problem for because hmm. not everyone is your customer True. So, and not, people can be your consumer without being your customer. Mm. The person who pays you is your customer. Huh. So know who your customer is. Clarify what the solution you are bringing, who you are serving, and what the offer mm. you are giving. That is the product you are giving them. Once you clarify that, then design the process. Okay, okay so how will I offer this? Will it be in form of a masterclass? Will it be a webinar? Will it be a book? Will it be a course? Would it be a master class? Whatever, right? Mm. Design the offer. Then once you get that, begin to sell. Mm. Sell on social media, your Instagram, dance on reels. Mm. <laughs> WhatsApp broadcasts. Mm. WhatsApp status. Yeah. Sell with content marketing. Teach some things to show that you are an expert. Mm. Teach a bit. Give some tips, some hacks, some address some common mistakes that mm. your clients are currently making mm. that positions you as an expert gives you an edge, it's an edge. Mm. so once you do that you are selling yourself right. selling your brand mm. and then they begin to ask you okay can you help me do this now the interesting part is that most of us people are already picking our brains for free mm. they come they call you they are on the chat with you please how do i fix this how do i do this and then you just give me giving me <laughs> The knowledge for free. Okay. Well, you could actually let, let Charge a fee for it. Okay. If not from them, from hmm. somebody. They finally deliver yeah. the expertise. Deliver the expertise. <laughs> yes. We are uh, actually out of time. But uh, just your, uh, your final words uh, for uh, people who are uh, already online but are struggling and they think that there should be more they can do. What's that one advice you give to them very quickly? I'll tell you, find a mentor. Find a trainer. The process can be a bit daunting. I have to admit, because mm. it's technical. And we're not so te technically inclined in Nigeria. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the internet is crappy. Yeah. So find a mentor can show you the step-by-step -step process. They can walk you through so that you don't fall too much. You will mm -hmm. fall, but mm -hmm. not too much. Don't stumble. You will, you will, you will <laughs> not go over. <laughs> you will not go over. Okay. So find someone can teach you and be willing to learn and okay. implement. All right. Thank you, Timmy, but uh, this uh, conversation is really very interesting, but then we have to, uh, you know, go because of time. It would be nice to really have you to have more conversations as regards, you know, when it comes to money, everyone is interested and everyone, you know, should uh, know how to do these things because they are really very basic things. Thank yes. you once again, Timmy. Thank you, JJ, for having me. It's been a pleasure. <laughs> And that's the size of the show for today. I must say a very big thank you to all of you who have sat back um, to what I trust you have been able to get something or even more on how you can actually make money online. We'll see you again next time. Bye for now.